Hello, it's Lolly. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, guys, is to share ko sa inyo kung paano ko na maintain ang aking blonde hair. Kung gusto niyo malaman kung ano ang aking hair care routine, please keep on watching. Alright guys, so before we jump into the video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. I-click mo na rin yung bell button beside it so you'll get notified whenever I upload a new video. So guys, ever since nag-start ang um, community quarantine natin dito sa Pilipinas, hindi na ako nagpasalon sa labas at nag na rin ako na pahabain yung hair ko which means kapag nagpakulay ako or nagpa-bleach sa salon, mas magiging mahal na siya. I do not recommend DIY bleaching kasi marami na rin nag-fail dyan and and nakakasira talaga ng buhok ang bleach. Kaya dapat yung merong alam ang gagawa sa inyo kung gusto nyong itry ang mag-bleach ng hair. So guys, kaya ako sinabi yon kasi recently lang na nag-bleach ako ng buhok kasi pinaprepare ko yung aking buhok dahil kukulay ako siya ng fun color sa mga susunod na araw. So, while my hair is still blonde, kailangan iiwasan natin ang pagiging brassy or yellowish ng ating blonde hair. Ang buhok kasi, pag nag-start tayo ng dark as in black, kapag ito ay binibleach, nagiging orange siya and then yellow until it becomes a pale yellow color. So, ano nga ba ang mga products na ginagamit ko para ma-maintain na hindi maging super brassy ng hair? What I have right now are from Luxless and it's their lavender and blue chamomile na purple shampoo and conditioner. So, why do we need a purple shampoo? Ang purple shampoo kasi, literal siya na color purple and it eliminates the brassy tone or the yellowish tone sa hair natin. Kapag kasi titingnan natin ang color wheel, ang kabaliktara ng yellow ay purple. So pag pinagmix mo ang purple and yellow together, it becomes brown or mga cool tone natin. If your hair is a little orangey pa, parang yung nandito sa tuktok ko, medyo orangey pa siya, what you need is a blue shampoo to cancel out orange kasi sila yung contrasting sa color wheel instead of purple. So sa demo ko guys, ang makikita nyo, ang mawawala lang ay yung mga yellow tone and not the orangey tone. Alright, so without further ado, let's go to the application. So what I did guys was I applied the shampoo on wet hair but I suggest if your hair is not light yellow yung parang medyo dark yellow pa siya malapit na siya maging orange gawin niyo siya in dry hair so ipapatong niyo yung purple shampoo sa dry hair so as you can see in the picture of my before and after, talagang nabura yung mga yellow tones sa hair ko. Pero ayon yung mga orangey, hindi siya masyadong natanggal. You can use purple shampoo whenever you see that your hair is getting brassy again. You don't have to use this every day, especially the shampoo. Kasi kapag yung shampoo, ilalagay niyo siya from roots to tips, nagda-dry talaga ng maigi yung buho. Yes! It's effective, but it will dry your hair, which is why you need to apply the conditioner afterwards para bumalik yung moisture sa hair nyo. Bleach in general can really damage your hair, but if you want it to look nice, even if it's damaged, use a purple shampoo and conditioner. So now that my hair is light, 
I think it's ready for a fun color. <laughs> so, kukulayan ko uli yung hair ko. Surprise na lang ko anong color ang makikita niya sa susunod. But right now, I'm just going to enjoy my blonde hair while it lasts. So, that's it for this video. I hope you like it. If you have any questions or suggestions, please leave it in the comment box below and I'll see you next time. Don't forget, smile! There's always a reason to be happy. Bye! I love, love.